Oh, hey, we're back. That's where we are. Still trying to get limits up. Everyone's dead, Dave. down. Yeah, everyone's dead, Dave. Everyone's dead. And this is the Trail of Blood music. It's uh, some of my favourite music. The bum 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 is really cool. Oh, we got into a fight. How fun. We're going to have to split the party up here, which I'm, I'm not best pleased about. Oh, wrong button. And they're all paralyzed now. So you couldn't steal, really. That's what Seal Evil does. It's great. We should do it more. Everyone's dead, Dave. M tentacles is the best one, I think, which is obviously Marlboro tentacles. But, uh, we're going to split the party up. And uh, here's old uh, Rufus, Rufus Shinra himself. Rufus Shinra? It's not Rufus Shinra at all. We're going to meet Rufus Shinra. He's dead. That music. Sephiroth. Yeah, for some reason only he can use that one sword and he left it inside President Shinra. But there's Palmer. Nepotism. I mean, that would never happen. Seen him what bleed? He's going to get a geo stigma later.
I love how they just s sort of introduce themselves here. Like, oh yeah, I'm a flower girl from the slums and I I'm a dog with one eye. Like, wh why are you doing that, dude? You don't need to <laughs> set yourselves up like that. And Rufus has his own doggo. Daddy tried to control the world with money and that worked for him. People believed that Shinra would protect them. Work at Shinra, get your pay. Terrorists attack the Shinra army will defend you. Oh god, doesn't this sound relevant today, eh? Eh, kids? It looked perfect on the outside. I do things differently. I'll control the world with fear. It's too much to do it like my old man. A little fear will control the minds of the common people. There's no reason to waste good money on them. I don't know if you can uh, steal anything from him. Now we're not actually going to fight him now. We're going to fight something called the Hundred Gunner. She has got uh, good. We're fighting a ranged boss, you see. And here's the, is it called the Hundred Gunners? We got to fight. Basically, this is a boss rush. Two bosses in a row. Oh, what have I done? Okay, well he's useless. Why didn't I give? <laughs> you fucking idiot! I was just checking. 
Uh, I can throw grenades, I guess. I should have given bolts to uh, Red 13, but I fucked up. This isn't a tough fight at all. It just means that um, I can only attack with two rather than three because I fucked up. Red 13 bolts, but uh, there we go. Yeah, see, I've, he's actually managed to get the sensor cannon off on me because I fucked up that bad. Uh... Here's the heli gunner. just going to take a little bit longer. So you do 146 with Bolt. We'll try him with a machine gun attack in a minute. I don't think he can steal. 146. Yeah. 57, right. Yeah, I really fucked that one, didn't I? Yeah, I'm out of practice. Whatever. Doink. Gonna go another round. Kill him with a limit. <coughs> I, I love fighting these Shinra mechs. Uh, carry armor was another great one. The proud clad. Right, we want to material wise. Uh, whack that on you. Let's give you. Elemental Bolt. Store. 
poison all. Steal. I don't think you can steal anything from him, but I might as well try. Making sense. That seems like it should be. Yep. Yeah. a big showdown with Rufus Shinra. You want the Promised Land and Sephiroth. Did you know he's an ancient? Whatever. I can't let either you or Sephiroth have the Promised Land. Which is funny, because they are actually allies in the sequel. But our setup should have rendered the doggo mute. Um, I don't know if we can sense. We can. He's only got 500 hit points. Dark Nation. Why would you call your dog Dark Nation? I think if you kill it, it casts Barrier and M-Barrier anyway. It's weird like that. I missed? fucking me up here. That helicopter just sort of... Does he have anything? He doesn't have anything. Rufus definitely has the best field uh, battlefield model. Or my favourite battle model. We got a guard source. Is it Barrett Cloud now? Ah, uh, I think we I think we get a chance to sort out their equipment in a minute. Well, before we do the uh, G bike. Eris. 
Anyway, we're going to motorcycle, and I can't remember how to play G-Bike. <laughs> this will probably be the highlight of Remake Part 1. This sequence could be amazing if they nail it. Again, I probably won't play it for two or three years, much like every other game that comes out. I mean, I could be playing uh, Resident Evil 2 right now. But we're playing this. And the last game we played was Plague Tale Innocence, and it took us a year to get there. So I hope you like mini games, because Final Fantasy VII has thousands of them. This is the second one after the squat thrusts we push square and circle right form party uh, menu I can put cover on, I guess. Don't know why I've got two fires. I think that was my fault. Okay. So, swipe, swipe. Oh my god, it looks amazing! I'm as terrible at this as I, as I was. You gotta try and get the one in front. So they crash. Ah, uh, early 3D game perspective. You can knock them down. Like that. Did you see that? I knocked him down and it took out the one behind him. Weirdly, when you play the G-Bike in uh, Gold Saucer, it's some fat white guy in the back of the car. It's not the characters. There we go. So we're actually driving through Midgar, which is fucking baller as fuck. And this blew my mind back in the day. I mean, we never thought the graphics were good, because they weren't. Fucking Duplo man. But uh, like, even when this came out, it looked terrible. But stuff like this was so cool to see. Uh, 
and we'll know when we're coming up because uh, is it called Motorball or so what's it? Motorola? That's a phone company. Thanks, perspective. There he is. Oh, thanks for that extra damage right at the end there, chap. Goal. And we get to fight the last boss of Midgar. And we didn't do too bad, friends. But he is going to wreck us. And I should have remembered that and swapped the rose around. But uh, that's the way things go, I'm afraid. I will take the time now to uh, swap the rose around. Who's got thunder? Did I not equip thunder? That was very silly of me. I didn't equip thunder, apparently. <laughs> I just made this fight a lot harder than it needs to be. After previously making a fight a lot harder than it needs to be. I good. I can't believe I didn't. Oh man. Really? I can't believe I didn't equip Thunder. I just rail on him there. This could take a while. It's fine, we've got a while. Nearly there. Steal anything off this chap? He may actually kill Tifa here. Unknown at this moment. Yeah, this is where we go. Huh, maybe I she might survive this. Yeah. We actually should be okay. Watch as he now nails Cloud. Nope, nailed it. Boo. And that was the motor ball. We got another star pendant for our trouble.
highways ended. What do we do now? Sephiroth is alive. I have to settle the score. One of the things I don't like is you can clearly see the, the backgrounds are just not quite right. They're a bit too schlubby. But you can barely see the bike and the, you can see the car because it's got the, the, the lights, but you can't see the bike. Barrett just wants to save the planet. Aerith needs to know what's going on. Aerith, sorry. That's going to be interesting hearing that. Guess it's goodbye, Midgar. <laughs> um, let's go. We need a leader for our journey. Of course, that could only be me. I think this is where Remake Part 1 is going to end, personally. I'd be sad if it did. We're northeast to a town called Calm. If something happens, we'll meet up there. <laughs> and that's it we can't go back we won't be able to go back for a very long time and then it will be plot mandatory welcome to the world map uh, we can save whenever we want which is good Oh, I didn't equip lightning, that's why I couldn't find it. <laughs> that's why I couldn't couldn't use lightning, because I didn't equip it like a bell end. What a tool I am, eh? Well, we made it out of Midgar. 